want that new pump. What new pump? The water pump is making funny noises. What kind of noises? Expensive. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. We'll fix the roof first and just hope the pump holds out. We're gonna have to come up with some extra money somehow. We could look for buried treasure. <laughs> Eat your breakfast. What? Well, Mr. Gutsy, there's lots of loot left in these hills. From outlaws like Joaquin Marietta. <laughs> well, he ought to know about outlaws. He holds me up every time I go in his general store. <laughs> well, we could dig for gold. Uh, there's not much of that left, Guthrie. You just spend days out there panning, you come up with nothing. Or you could strike Pater. <laughs> I think it'd be a good idea if you just concentrate on your chores and your schooling. We'll take care of the rest. Now, do we have any other ideas? Brian need you. Mm. Uh, need any help? Let's go help Anna. You okay? Yeah. I'm going into Murphy's. Well, come on. Do you have to change? You could put on a clean shirt. I like my men to look sharp. Thank you now. Thank you. Anna, is there anything else? I'm still looking. <laughs> You're in my way, boy. Bars of soap or, or, or seven, Hannah? Seven. 
Around our place, we wash off enough dirt to grow tomatoes. Well, howdy, Frank. What brings you to town? Are you tired of the woods? I'm tired of what people are doing in the woods. Uh, ben, would you put this up in your window for me? Uh, sure. When'd you start giving out rewards? Uh, one of my wardens got mauled by a wounded bear and nearly bled to death. Somebody's killing them for the parts. They uh, strip the fur and take the paws and the organs and leave the meat to rot. We've lost too many bears already, and now they're shooting the young ones before they're old enough to breed. <laughs> we could have an endangered species right here in our own backyard. You know, I don't understand hunters like that. Well, these aren't hunters. Hunters obey the seasons and help us manage the land and the animals. These are just cold-blooded, money-hungry killers. How can they make that much money? It's big money. That's the problem. They use the claws here for jewelry, and some folks in the Far East think bear organs are aphrodisiacs, like... Uh, like rhino horns in Africa. You mean to tell me somebody around here is killing God's creatures just to feed some silly superstition halfway around the world? Well, if I catch him, they'll wish the bear got to him first. But, well, ma'am, Ben, I appreciate Take it. Take care. Thank you. Yeah. Well, uh, is that all you need, Hannah? Hannah, what's an aphrodisiac? Uh, it's kind of like a vitamin for adults. You gonna get that for me, Guthrie? Yes, ma'am. I'll put it on the bill. Thanks. Mr. Gunn, how much are your pants? Oh, six to uh, ten dollars. You gonna do some plaster mining? Thinking about it. Trying to earn some extra money. Well, you should have a copy of my book. Gold Fever. Buck and a half, just for you. Well, I don't have a buck and a half. Pay me when you get your first strike. Thanks. My brother says most of the gold is gone from Carbon County. Is that so? If you was to mosey along the uh, north branch of the river where the bend is, uh -huh. you might be surprised at what you'd find. Don't tell nobody, just between you and me. Thanks, Mr. Gunn. Yeah, you bet. The only ones making money in that business are the ones selling the equipment. Well, I don't need much to get started. A pan, a crowbar. Well, I can make my own loose box. I could pay for the new roof all by myself. All right. Well, good luck. Grant, let's finish up this pie. Oh, no thanks, Gothry. I'm stuffed. Go on. You might not get another berry pie for a whole week. Okay. Thanks. Thank mm -hmm. you. 